More and more California restaurants and chefs are making their way to Europe. Here in London, you can get the Fairfax sandwich at one of Exlet's three locations, or order a pizza with gorgonzola at Pizzeria Moza. There's also Madeira, and a new spot from the chef of Night Market. Many of these restaurants have opened in the last year alone. Hi, I'm Javed Kaleem. I'm a national and international correspondent with the Los Angeles Times. I'm here in Soho in London. California cuisine is becoming popular here. Some restaurants have opened permanent locations. Others are popping up for the day, drawing huge lines. When In-N-Out came here a few years ago, people waited five hours. Yes, five hours for a double-double. While some places are introducing eaters to casual California dining, there are others that have bigger, more elaborate plans about what California means when it comes to food. I'm across the street from Sola, a California-inspired and themed tasting menu restaurant with a Michelin star, and I'm here to learn about what it means to be a California restaurant when you're so far removed from California, and what the idea of California even is. We're gonna do fine dining California cuisine. We're gonna show people that American food can be about more than burgers and pizza. Californian food is more of an ethos. It's more of a philosophy. It's about less butter, less cream, using produce only when it's in season. It's about lighter sauces, lighter preparations. It's about a delicate touch on things. At Sola, every dish gets a lot of thoughts. I know you guys have seen it's been on the menu for a while, but some of you may not have tried it. So, ikijime hamachi, yeah, sashimi, burnt baby leeks, hamachi tartare, edamame, pickled beech mushrooms, a dashi vinegar jelly, and then an avocado sorbet. Yeah, it's your opportunity to try it. An 11 course menu runs for more than $170. That's before wine pairings. The wine menu, designed by an American sommelier, is mostly wines from California. We have this wine, this is called a Cunoise. Uh, this is a wine that's from Santinez Valley, which is a couple hours north of LA. There are also a few from New York and Europe for variety. You'll find Napa and Sonoma, but you'll also find Santa Barbara, Santa Inez, and Santa Cruz. There's no denying that California is having a moment across the Atlantic. And it's about more than just avocado toast. 